uh, which was uh, prevailing in our network is concerned. Uh, the addresses which we have allocated has already been exhausted. Uh, in our country, 35 million IP4 addresses were there. And uh, of course, uh, data network users are more, so they are using through the net, which is not end to end transparent. So, Government of India has decided to implement IPv6 in our country. Uh, they have made the policy for implementation. Being state and central government department, most of the IP users, we have targeted to have IPv6 in the state government organizations in a phased and time bound manner, for which DOT has issued uh, roadmap also. As per roadmap, government has to all the government department has to be fully IPv6 by December 2017. For which today we have organized uh, IPv6 workshop for the state of Telangana, in which we will be telling them uh, what is IPv6, what was IPv4, what uh, benefits over and above on IPv6 we will get. Uh, you are aware that M2M and IoT, that is Internet of Things and machine-to-machine -machine communication is going to happen in our country through smart cities, smart tra intelligent traffic networks, so for which we need to have more and more addresses and IPv6 has 340 trillion 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 addresses through which we can have our all needs to be fulfilled it through IPv6. We will be telling uh, to the participant about the IPv6 applications, inherent applications which has got in the IPv6, how we can implement IPv6 in all type of smart cities projects, intelligent traffic systems and all.